As we continue up US 54 on our field trip, we're greeted by the Guadalupe Mountains, including Guadalupe Peak, the highest point in Texas. Guadalupe Mountains National Park first opened to the public in 1972. The lands for Guadalupe Mountains Park were donated by renowned geologist Wallace Pratt of the ExxonMobil Corporation. Wallace Pratt lived in a small stone cabin here in McKittrick Canyon, one of the scenic highlights of the park. Pratt realized that the Guadalupe Mountains preserved one of the world's best fossilized reefs. This Permian Reef is an underwater horseshoe-shaped ridge formed over 250 million years ago during the Permian period of geologic history. The reef formed along the coastline of a great ocean basin called the Delaware Basin, an extension of the Great Permian Basin of West Texas. This sentinel in the West Texas sky attracts not only professional geologists, but travelers, tourists, and hikers from all over the world each year in order to enjoy its scientific and its beautiful aspect. The park's visitor center has displays that explain more about the formation of the Permian Reef. Geologists have divided the rocks of the Guadalupes into three distinct groups, the fore reef, the reef, and the back reef. The fore reef is made up of rocks which formed from sediment and debris which collected in the deep ocean basin out in front of the reef. The reef itself comprises the highest peaks and cliffs of the mountains and can be seen from many points along the park road. The back reef is made up of rocks deposited in the shallow lagoons between the reef and the ancient shore, as well as the river and shoreline related deposits. And near the visitor center, at the base of the mountains, you can see the rocks that were once deposited in a nearby deep ocean basin. These rocks originated high up on the reef above and on the coastline further west. The Guadalupe Mountains really are a land of extremes, from harsh Chihuahuan desert lands to high mountains. It holds something for everyone. One of the most beautiful places, not only here in the mountains, but in the great state of Texas, is found here at McKittrick Canyon. One of the best ways to get up close and personal with the rocks of the Permian Reef is to take the Permian Reef Trail which bases out of McKittrick Canyon. It's a pretty long and steep trail, but it'll get you right up on the rocks and give you a first-hand look at the floor reef and the reef deposit near the top of the Guadalupe Mountains. When walking up the Guadalupe Trail, looking at all of these rocks, it's important to keep in mind that it was the tiny little marine organisms that built this entire thing. All sorts of fossils all contributed by dying to piling up this huge reef. It was all in a struggle to really get to the sun and get the ocean currents that were bringing oxygen up to the surface. This trail isn't the only place to see these organisms because this reef is over 300 miles long. Another famous national park, Carlsbad Caverns National Park, just up the road a piece here, is also embedded in the middle of this Permian Reef. You can also see these fossils there at Carlsbad, both under the mountain and on top of it. Mm -hmm. 